Well, it is no secret that restaurants have struggled throughout the pandemic, and we've been hearing from local restaurant owners on how they are just struggling to keep their doors open. We're joined now by the owner of Blue Bohem in Kensington, Ken Irvine. And Ken, thanks so much for joining us. Oh, my pleasure. It's uh, great to have you back out here in beautiful I know. Kensington. Well, the last time that I spoke, I actually got to see firsthand you were getting ready for that first day of outdoor dining. Um, it had just been allowed to resume. Tell us, what has it been since that day? What is, what's everything been like? Well, you know, it's been really confusing and, and difficult, uh, to say the least. Uh, we're open, we're closed, we're 25 or 50 percent. We're no seating indoors or outdoors. And it's been tough for our restaurant families as well. Um, you know, obviously, uh, unemployment has been tough because of all the fraud. Uh, and uh, so some of our team members weren't being taken care of with uh, what was due to them. And, you know, we've been seeing a lot of different colors, purple, green, what have you as well. And uh, we've been seeing a lot of red. So we're looking forward to finally being able to see a little black, if you know what I mean with finally being able to uh, make some income. Now, I'm, I'm wondering, Ken, have you had to, I know you have not had to hire someone in quite some time because of how many people love working there and have just been employees for decades and decades, but are you having to let people go, tell them to, to maybe come back once the uh, things pick up again, or what's the, what's the atmosphere like as far as that goes? Right, well, you know, I, I co-founded a takeout and delivery uh, tech company, and with that, we've been able to hire back some employees that we had to furlough or, or um, lay off. And so that's helped us out greatly. And having the outdoor, being, being creative has been key right now for uh, creating these outdoor areas for all of us. And we're pretty fortunate to be in an area where we're able to do that. There was a lot of restaurants in our community here in San Diego that weren't able to do that and have suffered uh, you know, tremendous consequences. And a lot of our, our, our friends in this industry won't be coming back, and we're thinking up to 30% of them. So it's just horrific. But we're thinking that uh, next week, perhaps, if we're fortunate enough, that we'll be back to uh, 25% at least indoors. And that's going to help out a lot. It's still not going to be enough, but it's definitely going to make an impact and help to bring, us back, bring back some of our employees that were laid off. We haven't hired a waiter at Blue Bohem in over 12 years, so we're really looking forward to having all our staff back. I remember you telling me that, and it has stuck with me. Certainly so many people not only love going there, enjoying the good food, but they love working there because of the environment you've created. Now, final question here. Tell me, what Thank do you, you wish you could say to those people who are making decisions right now? I know how far and above you've gone in making sure that everybody stays safe, and of course that is what the concern yeah. is. So what would you tell them if you uh, could about getting people back in? Well, I, I think that um, I, I don't hold anything against uh, the restaurants um, that have opened up uh, already. Um, there's people that are in dire need and their businesses are on the brink of failing. And so I, we have been very fortunate here in Kensington to be able to survive this pandemic, just barely surviving. Um, we're very fortunate. Um, we're, we're, we're hoping that, uh, you know, people who want to come out come out and join us when we open up indoors. We're still going to have our seating outdoors for those of us who don't want to join us indoors. But come out, have a good time. Let's get back to living and enjoying our lives here in San Diego, especially right now when we look across the rest of the country and see what they're dealing with with the weather. And I'm looking at beautiful blue skies, sun right now. It's about 65 degrees and absolutely Gorgeous. Certainly so much to be thankful for. And Ken, we are wishing you well. We are going to be uh, following this very closely. And hopefully when the next time we check back in with you, it will be open indoors to at least uh, some capacity. We appreciate your time. Have a good awesome. day. Awesome. Thank you. Thanks. Cheers.